Hi, this is David with David's Tutorials. In today's video, which is part of the Building Websites with David series, I'm going to show you how to clean up your WordPress media library. Let's get started. Now in a WordPress media library, you can have images, you can have videos, you can have audios, you can have PDF documents, you can have pretty much any kind of media that you want. And sometimes this media kind of piles up in the library, especially if you load up several images and you don't use them, or if you put them on a page as a placeholder and then you replace it with a real image, or if you have deleted the page and the images on that page are no longer good, then you don't need to keep those images in your media library. And I'm going to show you how to delete them. Okay, here we are on a web page for an auction site that I have built. And let's go over to the media library for this auction site. And you can see there are a whole bunch of images here. They like to put a lot of images up for each auction they have, but if you scroll down to the bottom, you can see that they have 8,582 items in their media library. That is a whole bunch, and they don't all apply to current auctions. So I'm going to show you how to do that. The first thing you need to do is to go up to the upper left-hand corner of your media library where it says all media items and drop that item down. You'll notice right down near the bottom, it says unattached. If you click on that, you will then get all of the images that are not attached to any page or post on your website. And you can see there are 654 of those. Well, out of 8,500, getting rid of 654 might be a good deal. Now, how do you get rid of these? Well, what you do is you do bulk select, and you can see the ones that are not selected are a little bit faded out. But if you click on one and you scroll all the way down to the bottom and you hold down shift and click on the last one, you can see they are all selected. Let's go through and there are some items in here you may not want to delete, in which case without holding shift, you can just click on one to undelete it. You can click on one to undelete it. Notice up here in the upper left hand corner, it says delete permanently. Well, now this is not my website, so I'm not going to be doing the deleting, but if I click this button here, it would delete all of these items permanently from the website. Let's just do one more website as an example. Here we have a local Lions Club website, and if we scroll down to the bottom, you can see that they have 354 items on the website and not all of those are attached. For example, the first two images here are the exact same image uploaded twice. And I think that they are not both attached to a post or a page. So let's come up here to where it says all media items, select unattached, and look at all these items that are not attached. It looks like there are 241 items that are not attached to a page or a post. So if you then do bulk select, click on the first one, scroll down, and click on the last one. You'll notice you're only seeing 80 of the 241 of them. You can then come up here, and if you wish, you can delete them permanently, or you can unselect any various items that you do not want to delete permanently. Again, this is not my website, so I'm not going to delete it, but this is how you clean up your WordPress media library. And once you delete permanently all the ones on this screen, you'll then get the next screen. Unfortunately, I don't see any way that you can delete more than 80 of them at one time, depending on how many you have showing on your particular screen. So if you thought this was a great video, which of course, who wouldn't? Go ahead and give me that thumbs up. Share this video with other people you know that have WordPress websites and leave me a comment down in the comment section below. If you're already a subscriber, thank you so much. I appreciate every single one of you. And if you're not, go ahead right now, click that subscribe button and then the bell icon so YouTube will let you know when I post another great video right here on the David Tutorials website. And in the meantime, everybody have a wonderful day. Take care and I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye.